Well, hello. It's the 2nd of September 2017, 06.37 hours British summer time. It's autumn, or maybe fall, if you're in the Americas. Brewfest Cardiff Day. Opens at 12. I think I'm going to have a coffee beforehand, and maybe even a subway. Oh, yeah. Very autumnal. It has that chill, that coldness. Coldness? Hmm. Coolness. Hmm. Indian summer? Well, it just might be. Apart from tomorrow when it's going to hammer down. That's real autumn. <laughs> I suppose I should have checked the card. I need to check the card. So I need coffee. Um, yeah. However, gatekeeper to start anyway. Upstairs, away from people, close to the toilet, with the carpet, and a copy of Beer Necessities. Beer Festival issue. Anyway, uh, this is Sunbeam. Banks 4.2%, supposed to be citrusy. Hmm. Certainly has a citrus stroke grapefruit finish. But all in all, it's a bit, hmm, yeah, could be so much better sort of thing. B plus. Probably more for this. There we are, Mr. Manning. Nice bit of floor covering. And there's the bar, which isn't open yet. Hidden away. This is Gone Fishing by Green Jack Brewing. Extra special bitter, 5.5% alcohol by volume. This will be my last one, sure. The debate is, should I wander over Caroline Street and have a bag of chips? I don't see why not. Oh, I could go, there's a mm, subway on the way. I'm not sure. Anyway, it's all about beer. Hmm, I'm getting citrusy, hoppy niceness. Oh, strong. It's, it's malty, but there's a sort of sweet citrus finish. And some bitterness now. Um, we plus in a bit. Yeah. Right, so well, that bus is just coming round. Turn left there, probably about five minutes work, less than that. So, lining the stomach right now. It's time to go fast. Wish you. Wish you. And here's the queue. I'm seeing take down music already. Anyway, there's the tree. We're in business. Okay, so who have we got here? <laughs> Excellent. Real cider. Blue dog is here. Thornbridge is here. Cider. Gin? Who's gin? Mad dog. Hey, that's that French stuff from last year. Let's have a look at that. <laughs> Crafty Devil. Drink more beer. Mm -hmm. Lucky Seven. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That tiny rebel. Hawk's Head, Siren. Apple. 
For pure heavy industry, bossa shit. So bossa shit, and there's the tree. Yeah. Grilled cheese. I'm not keen on grilled cheese. Tiny rebel. More tiny rebel. What is it, bash? Okay, get some pictures, get some beer. So here's my plan of attack. Stuff that I normally wouldn't get. This is Mango Rising. It's from France. La Dubouche. 4.5% alcohol by volume. It's supposed to be a sour mango beer. Look, almost real glass. Glass? Glass. Okay, get in the mangoes. Mmm. Ooh, lovely finish. Mr. Manning, concrete. Sharp and sour and... B plus plus. Yeah. Great music, great takedown. Anyway, those boys over... Oh, Those boys over there. I thought it was Enfield, but it's NFL, but in London. And I'm drinking the Raspberry Pale at 3.8% alcohol by volume. I love the tree. Mr. Manning, still concrete. Huge raspberry. sweetness in the raspberry but a bit like a spicy finish I don't know but I'm thinking there's a lot going on there that's another B plus plus I'll get over that yeah okay started in France then I went to London this is also from London this is from Bermondsey for pure brewing over there. Anyway, this is Juice Box. 8.3% alcohol by volume. Uh, double IPA, citrus. And nice people. Entertainment. More entertainment. Smells hugely pretty. Blow your head off. Blow your head off, but really, really strong. You can get the alcohol, but it's not overpowering. But that's a huge fruit alcohol bomb. B plus plus. London, London, Aberdeen in Scotland. Although I'm thinking, that's Norway. Actually, that's Bristol. It's so hard. Anyway, this is Tangerine Tart. A sour, four and a half percent alcohol by volume by Fierce Beer. It's still concrete, Mr. Manning. Oh wow, this is great. Okay, I'll be honest, this is sour. I'm gonna have sours. There's just a hint of tangerine in it. But B plus plus. This is really good. It 
turns out I was completely wrong. Lucky Sam Rowley's from Heyong Wai. I will get the Norwegian Rowley. Anyway, this is Mist. New England Pale Ale. 6.7% alcohol, that's not too bad, I could drink that. Mosaic and Azaka. Mr. Mahan. And it smells lovely. Thornbridge. Thornbridge. Oh yeah. You can taste the alcohol, but it's not overpowering. And it's Welsh. A plus plus. <laughs> oh, what a Welsh beer. In the style of a new English BIPA. Finally, a Norwegian ale. That's served by the guy from Bulldog. This is Mayabit Raspberry and Licorice Sour. Five point five percent alcohol by volume, and the brewery is I'm still here. Seven to gel. Anyway, that's some day. You can't see much of them actually. That's a B plus plus in a bit. It's 3.75 on the untap scale. Absolutely wonderful. 